if you watch my previous videos which were about adding highlight, shadows and removing the background. In this video I am going to try to explain three methods of adding glow on Photoshop. If you want to know these steps and tricks and methods of adding glow, watch my video up to end and before that if you are new to my channel, subscribe and also press the bell icon to don't miss any single video. Let's get into it. The first method which I am going to explain for you are that you can use this method in every different project that you want to add glow. It don't have any difference, this is the common method of adding glow. Let's see what the method is this. Ladies and gentlemen, here we are on Photoshop Workspace and as you see I have a black screen with the orange dot and I want to add a glow to this. The first thing that we need to do is create a new solid color adjustment layer with that color which we want to add glow. I want to use the orange for this and after that change its blending mode to the linear that add and Select the mask, press Ctrl I to make it invert. Grab your brush and also you can select it by pressing the B letter on your keyboard. After that, check the hardness must be 0. The opacity must be 100 and the follow the maximum number of flow for having a on Photoshop is 10, not too much and I'm going to use 9 and I don't have any difference. After that, check the foreground color must be white, like this. As you see, I have added glow this and before, after. For making it too much advanced, we need to have a duplicate of the solid color adjustment layer. Select the layer mask and press delete to delete the mask and change the color to some lighter like this. Hold the Alt key on your keyboard and after that click on the mask option to have inverted mask. Again, grab your brush, paint in here. Let's me to make it screw it together and before, after. It was the first method of having glow by using Photoshop and you can use the same trick for everything you want. Have an example for this when you want to add go with the heights or sand moon or something like this you can use from this thread and uh, let's jump to the second method by the using the second method you can add uh, or you can create a new glow power on both the lamp you can use from this track and i have one bulb on my photoshop workspace and uh, let's start adding glow you can create the solid color as the same or you can create a new layer and add a color to that. I am going to use from the solid color. Again, create a new solid color adjustment layer with that color that you want to add glow. Open the blending option and uncheck the transparency shapes layer. After that, press OK. Select the layer mask and press Ctrl I from your keyboard to make it invert. Grab your brush by pressing P, B, B on your keyboard. You can select that and in here you can have about 50% flow. On the start point, hold the shift key on your keyboard and click at the end point like that and change its blending mode to the linear touch add like this you can use do the same thing for this click at the start point and end point the start point end point the start point and the same end point as you see it look like power on but if it's too much, you can change the fill like this before, after. For adding glow to this, use the previous trick that I explained for you. Duplicate your solid color adjustment layer. 
the lid to layer mask and hold your alt key and click on the mask option to have an inverted mask. Take care that the mask be the linear dash at. Change the scale to 100. Grab your brush and check the follow mask be 9 or 10. And now it's time for adding glue. 1, 2, 3, and 4. And if we merge it with together to a group, we can see our work what we did before, after. It was the second method of adding glow by using Photoshop. You can use this trick for power on the lamp, bulb, or if you want to create a new style on Photoshop, you can use this method. And now let's go to the third method of adding glow. At the third method, we have different work because our subject is higher color and we want to add different color to that, different glow to that. So let's get into it. And here I have gel text in my channel name and I want to add other color glow to that because I explained it for you that how you can add color the same with the subject and now let's do this. If you want to add glow to this text, you can uh, go to the blending option, outer glow and select the color that you want. Let me choose one color for this. Something like this. There you go. Opacity mask be handled as it has a difference that in where you want to add how much glow, how much transparency you want to add glow to that subject. It has a difference. But you must take care that the spread must be about 3 or 4, not too much. And press. And you can copy it from this place. Press OK and OK. Create a new layer. Grab your brush, change this color to the 100 and make it size bigger as it looks. Now here, fill the color that you copy and press OK. Click like this. Change this blending mode to soft light. Open the blending option, hold the Alt key and drag it to the right, like this. And before, after. And also you can set the glow opposite as it looks nice. And let me to change this to a layer. It was this video's tutorial that explained for you that how you can add glow by using Photoshop and three different methods. The first method is the common method that you can use it in every single project that you want. It doesn't have any limit. But the second method, you can use it for making something lighten or too much hot or you can for power owning the lamp, new effect, that method was about adding glow, the subject would have different color. If you learned something from this video, make sure that comment it below for me, leave a like to my video, and if you don't subscribe to my channel, don't forget it to press subscribe and press the bell icon to don't miss any single video. See you on my next video.